The fourth and final building block of music, and one of the most exciting areas for anyone who likes the physical feel of paint, is brushwork. This is something that many paintings lack, probably because it's very difficult to do well. This is partly because you need a strong foundation in realism and the other foundation building blocks of music in order to be able to do brushwork well. Let's take a look at why this is such an important integral part of the music in a painting. Let's take a look at some abstract paintings. Here is an abstract painting that consists of grayed green and blue shapes and the occasional speck of intense orange. Here's another very different abstract design. This time the painting uses high intensity pinks, yellows and oranges and has a great contrast in value. Here's yet another abstract design that combines the two color schemes. Now each of these three designs is an interesting painting. Yet all of these abstract paintings were embodied in this single representational work. This is a painting I did of some washing hanging outside a farmer's cottage in Jilin in northern China. And this is how the pieces fit together. So you can see that this single painting had dozens of small abstract compositions buried within it for the viewer to discover. This is what makes the painting so interesting to look at. And it's the brushwork that makes all this happen. Let's take a look at another series. This painting is an abstract composition of blue and gold flecks of paint and patterns of thin dark lines. And this abstract composition has a completely different feel to it, but again composed with blues and small areas of red and interesting patterns of brushwork. But in fact, these two parts both belong to this same impressionist street scene. And this is how they fit together. Once again, we have multiple abstract paintings within a single painting, creating a beautiful and interesting surface to look at. Here's a very interesting abstract design of beautiful blue and red violet greys and various shapes painted with an intense aquamarine blue. But in reality, it's only a very small part of a very realistic painting by the American artist John Singer Sargent. It is said that Sargent sometimes repainted the same stroke six or seven times to make it look so abstract and yet at the same time have a realistic effect when viewed from a long distance. This incredible skill is what, to my mind, makes Sargent stand out as a great master. Let's take a look at this portrait I did of a painter friend as he was finishing off a Tuscan landscape in the late evening sun. We can zoom into the painting and just look at a part of it. When we do that, you will find interesting patterns and designs that create a sort of mini composition just like this one. And if we look somewhere else, we'll find a second composition like this. And in yet another place, a third composition, this time with a completely different set of colours and colour harmony. And we can go on and on, finding hundreds of small individual compositions all embedded in the same painting. So my goal here was to keep the brush strokes fresh and clean to create an interesting paint surface with all of these interesting designs embedded in it, but that at the same time create a convincing portrait. To create paintings like these, not only will you need to learn about brushwork, but you'll also need to work on all of your other foundation skills. In fact, for this painting, the most critical foundation block is the one called observation. Without that building block, this painting would be impossible to do, because if you don't get the colour right the first time, you will end up with an overworked or overblended paint surface that does not contain any interesting brushwork. Now you have seen why brushwork is so important but also why it relies on the rest of the foundation that you have built for yourself. 
This completes the four key building blocks of music, notan, color, composition, and brushwork. In the next lecture, we are going to look at the final foundation of painting, the one that builds on all of the other building blocks of your foundation, and that elevates a painting into a work of art.